The Museum of Country Life in Castle Bar, Ireland, showcases a historical relic dating back to 1850, a traditional Irish Halloween jack-o'-lantern skillfully carved from a humble turnip. This terrifying example reveals the intriguing fact that the early iterations of Irish jack-o'-lanterns were notably different, lacking the playful and child-friendly nature we associate with modern versions. The seated male figure from Mexico, belonging to the Maya civilization and dating back to 550, 850 AD, is a significant artifact from the pre-Columbian era. This sculpture likely holds cultural and historical importance, representing the artistry and iconography of the Maya people during that time. A newly discovered bronze mirror, adorned with a pattern of concentric circles, in a 2300-year-old grave in Israel. This mirror offers a fascinating glimpse into the life and culture of the time, as it is believed to have belonged to a Greek courtesan who may have accompanied Alexander the Great's army. The bronze belt buckle, shaped like a rhinoceros from China, dating back to the Warring States period between the 5th and 3rd centuries BC, is an intriguing artifact. The sculpture of Varokana at Enyoji Temple in Japan, dating from the Heian period in the 12th century, is a historically rich piece of art. Varokana is a central figure in Buddhist cosmology, representing the Dharma body of the Buddha. The jade floral pendants from the Jin dynasty in northern China, dating from the Great Jin period, 1115 to 1234 CE, are exquisite examples of Chinese jade craftsmanship. These pendants showcase intricate carving and attention to detail, reflecting the high level of skill possessed by artisans of that era. The Wukai porcelain jar, known as the Keswick Hundred Deer Jar, is a magnificent artifact from the Ming Dynasty, specifically from the Wanlai period, circa 1573 to 1620 AD. The Kum Kum, or perfume sprinkler, with a banded pattern from Syria, dating back to the 13th century, is a beautiful example of Islamic art and craftsmanship. These intricately designed perfume sprinklers were used in various Islamic cultures to disperse fragrances, and they often featured exquisite patterns and decorations. The leaf-shaped altar decoration from Shishia, Western Shia or Great Shia, dating back to the early 13th century. Shishia was a medieval Tibetan Buddhist kingdom located in what is now northwestern China. This leaf-shaped decoration likely played a role in religious rituals or temple ornamentation, reflecting the rich artistic and spiritual heritage of the Shishia culture. The red and blue laced suit of armor from the Ki Tokugawa family, dating from the mid 17th century, is a magnificent piece of Japanese armor craftsmanship. It represents the rich samurai heritage of Japan and the meticulous attention to detail in creating protective and ornamental armor for warriors. The use of various materials such as iron, leather, lacquer, silk, wood, gold leaf, and bare fur showcases the complexity and artistry involved in crafting such suits of armor. The ceramic jug with the head of a phoenix from the Five Dynasties and Ten Kingdoms period in China, 907 to 960 CE, is a captivating artifact. The Corinthian bronze ancient Greek helmet from the 5th century BC, housed at the Metropolitan Museum of Art, helmets like this were vital for protecting soldiers in battle and have become iconic symbols of ancient Greek warriors. 
The 8,000-year-old goddess figurines from Sha'ar Hagolan, Israel, originating from the Yarmoukian culture, 6,400 to 6,000 BC, these figurines, believed to represent female fertility deities, offer valuable insights into the spiritual and religious beliefs of the people of that time. The Tang Dynasty ceramic figures of a man and a woman, crafted in China during the 8th century CE, are exquisite examples of Chinese ceramic artistry from a culturally rich period in Chinese history. The Tang Dynasty is renowned for its advancements in art, culture, and technology, and these figures showcase the artistic mastery of that era. The ceramic bottle with a multicolored glaze from China, created during the Qing Dynasty in the 18th century, is a testament to the artistry and craftsmanship of this period. The Qing Dynasty was known for its intricate and colorful porcelain and ceramic creations. The discovery of sandals in the Cueva de los Murciélagos in Spain, dating from 7,500 to 5,000 BC, is a remarkable archaeological find. These sandals are considered among the world's oldest shoes and provide important insights into the footwear of early human societies. The clam-shaped silver cosmetic box with a bird and floral design from the late 7th century to the early 8th century CE during the Tang Dynasty in China is a magnificent example of Tang Dynasty craftsmanship. The storage chests with brass fittings from Korea dating to the 19th century during the Joseon Dynasty is a beautiful example of Korean craftsmanship from this period. The two funerary masks from Egypt, dating to the Roman period in the first century BC, funerary masks were a common feature in ancient Egyptian burial customs, and they were placed over the faces of the deceased to protect and guide the spirit in the afterlife. The 10.21 gram 12 litri coin from the fifth democracy of Syracuse is a numismatic artifact of significant historical and cultural importance. This coin features depictions of Athena wearing a Corinthian helmet and a pearl necklace on the obverse side, and Artemis in hunting gear with a hunting dog at her side on the reverse side. The Roman marble statue from Tusculum, Italy, dating to around 2,000 years ago in the first century BC, is an intriguing archaeological find. Roman marble sculptures are renowned for their artistry and historical significance, often depicting gods, emperors, or important figures. The jade tablets inscribed with an essay by the Qianlong Emperor, dating from the Qing Dynasty in China, 1735 to 1795, are exceptional artifacts that hold great historical and cultural significance. Emperor Qianlong, one of the longest reigning emperors in Chinese history, was known for his patronage of the arts and literature. The Sui Dynasty, 581 to 618 CE, or Tang Dynasty, 618 to 907 CE, candlestick with a dragon, originating from northern China and currently housed in the Musée Guimet in France, is a magnificent example of Chinese metalwork and artistry from a historically rich period. The incense burner from the Western Han Dynasty, dating back to the 2nd century BCE, is an extraordinary artifact made of bronze and adorned with gold, silver, turquoise, and carnelian. It exemplifies the exceptional craftsmanship of the Western Han Dynasty in China.